Welcome back to our YouTube channel. My name's Ardil and today we're talking all about a brand new product, or should we say volume two of an incredible product. We have Target Blue Eye 2. What is Target Blue Eye? For those of you who haven't seen it on our channel, but also haven't heard of the product before, it is an emergency service warning device. What it does is it alerts you of emergency service vehicle as you approach them in real time. Three, and right on top of us we have now and later on there was another one pretty neat device isn't it so target blue eye one has been around since for a long long time now i think we started installing them in about 2014 basically during the lockdown and all the chip shortages and stuff basically couldn't manufacture them anymore so they decided to release a new product which is target blue eye 2 so today's video, I'm gonna be talking all about the new product, the advantages of moving over to the new system, and the future plans for this product, because this really does move into the future in terms of actually upgrading the system down the line. And we're gonna be talking about a big talking point, which is moving over from Tetra to ESN and how this product can handle that. What on earth is Target Blue Eye? And what is Target Blue Eye 2? And what are the difference is? So Target Blue Eye 1 is an emergency service warning device, basically alerts you via visual and audible tone of approaching emergency service vehicles. However, there has been this big talk about the changeover from something called Tetra, which is what the network of the emergency services use to contact each other on, that's called Tetra, and they're moving over to something called ESN, the Emergency Service Network. What that basically changeover means is that Target Blue Eye 1, or for those of you who already have that installed in your current vehicle, when the changeover happens, that product will no longer work or be supported. So, basically due to the massive chip shortage that happened all over the world, Target Blue Eye couldn't manufacture that product anymore, so they took time and designed a brand new product that is future-proofed. This is Target Blue Eye 2. Very similar in terms of how the kit works, but it's more sensitive and it's overall just a better product. So Target Blue Eye 1 was incredible, absolutely fantastic. I hated driving a car without it, but Target Blue Eye 2, I'm sure I'm gonna love even more. So what the product basically is in terms of this control box is it does the same thing. It alerts you by a visual and audible tone of emergency service vehicles. But the big thing is when the changeover happens from Tetra to ESN, this virus software update will be able to be upgraded to be able to handle that change and then work with and pick up on the ESM frequency that the emergency services will use. And this is across marked and unmarked vehicles. Tetra is used currently, ESN is what's gonna be used, but this little product will be able to cope with both via a software update whenever that changeover happens. I mean, they're estimating around about 2027. I think the original date was 2012, so you can see where that's going along. But overall, I'm sure it's gonna be a brilliant product. In terms of what you actually get in the kit here, this is the Target Blue Eye 2 box. You've got display cable that goes into this little PCB board. What this board actually allows us to do is mount this into your factory mirror or other panels in your vehicle. There's a strip of LEDs along the top, a strip of LEDs along the bottom. So what this display will allow us to do is it actually goes from green to red as you approach emergency service vehicles. And this is really cool. The fact that you'll actually be able to tell on the bottom row of LEDs how many emergency service vehicles are actually in your area. So that's one to three at a maximum. You've also got on the other side of the actual uh, PCB board is integration for laser track. So that if there's another product which is an automatic gate opening system that can integrate in to this display as well which is pretty cool. But yeah it is really cool that we can actually integrate this into the factory uh, into like your factory mirror like we've done on previous Target Blue Eye 1 installs however this is a lot slimmer a lot sleeker which will make everything a lot easier our end which will also make things better your end as well it's more compact it's sleeker design nothing's on display but you know exactly what is out there so that's a little PCB board. Later on, there's a couple of future upgrades to come. There'll be a whole nother unit available which will be able to have what's called dual antenna. So currently on this system on Target Blue Eye 2, we have basically one antenna that we mounted in the front of the vehicle, which gets given in the kit. 
One really cool thing later on in a couple of months time, or there's no set date yet, there'll be an upgraded version to this that will have the ability to have two antennas, so front and back, which is really cool giving us more coverage in terms of that scope of where those emergency service vehicles are. And you'll also be able to know, so say you're on a motorway, you'll be able to tell whether that emergency service marked or unmarked will be in front of you or behind you, which is really cool. But that will be a whole different product that you can upgrade later on. But for now, obviously Target Blue Eye 1 is no longer manufactured. It's been upgraded to this, which is Target Blue Eye 2. So you get still one antenna, but this, the main reason for kind of going down this route is if you want to know where emergency service vehicles are, it's a lot more sensitive, which means it's going to pick up a lot better. Plus what this actual system does is it's ready to be supported on that ESN network whenever that changeover does happen, which will be really cool as well. So after this video, I'm actually going to be installing this into my Ford Mustang demo car, doing the UK testing side by side comparison between this and Target Blue Eye 1, showing exactly and learning a little bit more about how accurate this product is in terms of a comparison from Blue Eye 1 to Blue Eye 2. So we're gonna run two antennas in, we're gonna be running both Blue Eyes integrated into my mirror. I'll be able to see side by side how good this system is and I'm sure it's gonna blow it out of the park. I'm sure I'm gonna love the product and really enjoy having more sensitivity and really picking up on more emergency service vehicles that are around me. And I know that this product is something that I wanna to wanna to be driving without. And I'm sure now you've watched today's video, You'll probably want to do the same, but thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. If you're interested in buying one of these products, get in touch with us. All of our details are in the description below, but thank you once again, and we'll see you on the next one.